open from the from a teacher. So we built this uh, two houses, and then uh, we work together with the, with the people here and also with the volunteer. So what next? Maybe next uh, next month we have another group for for uh, making a small house. So we were work by ourselves and then with the guide of the people also from from here. So I will try to bring you around here. Yeah. Yes, I It's very uh, high. So you may ask why? Because the water level in Cambodia during the rainy season will climb. So if there is flood, so the water is everywhere in, in this village. Uh, rainy season, we just have uh, two months. Uh, last month, that's the end of rainy season for six months. So now it's the start of a dry, uh, dry season, which means January, February, March, April, May. June will be starting to rain again. So six months very dry, like this, you see? And then one of our problems here also, in, not only on this village, but in Cambodia, uh, the garbage. So maybe one of the group, uh, next time I will invite you to make a, we clean. Okay. It's our uh, center, learning center. So it's like in town, we have children also. But here we have uh, around 40 active, like which means active, which means go to school every day. Small because once they grow older or bigger, they move to another school. You see, before we uh, enter, we turn left. There is a public school. It's uh, from government school. So after they grow bigger, uh, they move to the school. So we have uh, this year we have very small and you will see them later on and we have around 40 every day or 30 to 40 but on our rice soup program because we have rice soup do you understand rice soup like we feed the children we have around 250 mm -hmm. or 300 yeah it's all from this village and this village we have uh, at least 80 uh, families and we have the, this village is the very poor villages among the other other village and um, we have also um, the church in Shimrit where we, we stay the Catholic Church uh, with the help of uh, volunteers and uh, pe uh, people from outside we are able to build the uh, help to build houses uh, back to 10 years ago and then we continue and here also we have this program washing the kids kids Last, last, uh, the first batch, last, uh, this, uh, the other year, the last batch, so we went to watch the kids, and Mati, uh, the t teacher, he came also, and then we were watching the kids, but I don't know we have this today, maybe we have only rice soup. Then after we moved to the farm. Yeah. So I think in, in Cambodia, one of the, uh, we notice, we can see, they have uh, dogs, uh, small small pigs and chicken because it's very important and cows also cows like uh, castle so uh, dog eats the eat for meat so because it's very cheap and easy to uh, easy to take care like you just uh, raise dog and then you live alone and you uh, feed sometimes and then they will kill for meat and the, the meat is very nice also you want so to eat? So they eat dogs? Yeah, they eat dogs. You see, that, that's for, for meat. And also they have a pig and they have cows. In the farm I have project cows. We bought cows from, uh, from uh, friends. The money is from uh, some from Australia, from uh, Canada. So we buy cows and we give to these four families. So these families, we have maybe we have around 20 cows I give uh, to these families. And then we'll have small baby. We will, we, they will give back the baby to the church and then they, the next baby will be belongs to them and then the next one two is for us and two for them including the mother so it's very good project for for, uh, for the family so uh, we have around uh, 20 cows for this village but outside also we we have some people outside get uh, get our cows so maybe we have twin, uh, six other people from outside the uh, Ronato says this is the same thing as Ronato has been doing a thing called Niu Yinhang called Cow Bank which is buying a cow and giving it to this family and then the first 
它留下来，第二只再回给教会，就这样延续下来，所以它就可以有自己的牛。因为牛是一个重要的财产，这样。那台湾其实早期在村庄有做 chicken bank， I told them， 呃、uh, ，in Taiwan is called chicken bank， also one thousand egg for you and the one maybe ten chicken and after you can have your own chicken， yeah。哦、yeah, ，所以在台湾 ，Yeah, yeah, yeah, yeah. 那刚刚讲狗肉，这边吃狗肉。那台湾其实呃 ，twenty years ago， 台湾 also eat the dog also， but now is illegal because the animal conservation. But but just yesterday, I see the news. Some illegal dog meat also sell in the market. <laughs> But it's illegal, yeah. So it's not not good, not not break the law, yeah. Break the law in Taiwan. 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 And uh, I would like to, I would like to, I forget to explain a little bit about this. So this village name PS9 Cha. PS9 Cha. PS9. PS9. Cha. Cha is uh, which means old. Oh. And then new is uh, mine. Right. In the farm they call PS9 mine, which means PS9 new. new. And this is PS9 uh, old. PS9, which means PS is to to wear. Like to wear uh, clothes. Snain is horn. Snain. Yeah, yeah, horn. Yeah, snain, which means to wear uh, horn. But I don't get the real meaning of uh, because I asked the people. They, they, uh, they told me I don't know why they call uh, to wear horn. Maybe I believe that there is a history. Yeah, but I didn't get the real answer as, as for now. And uh, you know the people here. They get uh, if they work, so they get like at least 1.5 dollar a day or two two dollar a day, and that two dollar is to feed for the family with three kids, four kids for one day. 就是一天只有一两块美金 for one、uh, one family 呢，可能五个人的一天的生活费。Uh, you see how 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 two dollars very important in Cambodia. In in Taiwan, I think.、Uh, Do you use coins? Coin, yes, coin. Yeah. So maybe you are, you have a lot of coins. You want to get rid. You just you know <laughs> buy something that that it's not important because you want to get rid of the、uh, coins. The same when I work in in Canada before. I have a lot of coins, and then I want just to buy something that important because I don't feel the value of、uh, one dollar coins. But when I come, I came here. I really learn how much is. Uh, one dollar for the Cambodian people, so there is a. I learn a lot of this one dollar, and now like if I see one dollar they spend for nothing, it's like I, I regret because it, you could help、uh, one family for 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 food. You know now is many restaurant near the university. Just one meals for ten dollars, five dollars to ten dollars near the university right now. University of.、Uh, For student, it's many restaurant nearby. It's maybe cost five dollars to US ten dollars, 对不对？一个 buffet 一个都是就是十块美金嘛。在大学，现在那个台大那个餐厅，台湾，台湾， yeah, many university the higher expense right now. Very expensive, and he will like three days for the family and Cambodia to feed the children. So. In other words, we are very lucky, and you are very lucky. And this is my real,、uh, this is my realization. When I do some volunteers in Cambodia, this is the thing that I have to say, thanks for this experience. So、uh, it、uh, made me a lot. I learned a lot of things about uh, about uh, a way of life, and I learned to share、uh, with the people, and I learned to live in a very simple way.、Uh, even I want to live very simple, but I still find it that. I am luxurious than other people, you know. I can eat whatever I want now. I don't have a, a lot of money because I I do volunteers. I don't receive a salary at all. But、uh, they take care of me. The church is taking care of me. I have no problem. So, but I still found that I still have a lot compared to these people, you know. But you might say, oh, they have big house. But these houses. 
they, they cut trees from the jungle. This wood, they cut from the jungle, so they are able to build for their house. So some are farmers also. But here, the people, they can have, uh, they have two livelihood, like way of, uh, way of living, uh, catching f fishermen on the rainy season, because when the rain comes in Cambodia, all over Cambodia, a lot of fish. Or it together, <laughs> yeah. You, yeah. Yeah, on the water, you can have a lot of fish. So they're quite lucky. So on the dry season, these people became a fisherman. And then on a dry season, they became a um. farmer. But when there is no rain, they, beca they became a cutting a trees. Uh, how do you call that? Illegal. Uh, illegal, just yeah. they do, they, They're doing illegal things because they cut the woods for the fire. For the fire, for sale. For sale. To to for. To survive. 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 To Pump the water, but half years ago it's hard to have the water yeah, irrigation in the farm also. You saw that in the you the house is made of wood, but when the flood comes, then will the, will the wood turn into bad or what? Uh, no, because this is a special wood. Oh, they don't afraid, they don't afraid of no, water. No, this is a uh, uh, will will uh, survive with water, will sur survive with heat. Special uh, special wood from the jungle. So it's quite expensive to, uh, to, to buy. Uh, some, some, some people, they use cement like that. Cement, yeah. So you can tell your own name, and write your own name in English, and write them in English. But if you ask, you can
Om Om.
先那边。